We've made it to the final week of regional play, and we had a six-pack of action in the Northwest bracket at Wallace State Community College. We started with a double-decker of Deschler as both the girls and guys teams faced Good Hope for the right to a 4A regional title game. Let's go to the girls' game. Good Hope jumped out to a 21-9 lead after the first quarter, but the Tigers were trying to get back into it. Reese Davis will show off her ball handling skills. She brings her defender along for a grand tour of the mid-range before turning the corner, getting by her for a runner. It was 27-19 at that point. The Tigers couldn't breach Good Hope's double-digit lead for long. It ends in a blowout. Final score, 68-45. Deschler and Good Hope's guys were next, and both teams were comfortable playing at a quicker pace. Deschler closed out the half on a run thanks to jump shooting. Aiden Woody gets it in the wing and relocates with a pretty step back to make it an eight-point game with 1.32 to go in the half. Next time down the floor, Woody has it again beyond the arc. He's got Garrett Reed available just to his right. Easy catch and shoot to get their lead back to eight with under a minute and a half. A third quarter surge by Deschler gives them the lead they need to advance to the regional finals. The second 3A girls semifinal all came down to the final minute. Priceville with it now, driving. Grayson Prater is left wide open and she makes him pay. The jumper makes it a 42-41 game. Bulldogs get it back. They go to the big man, Abby Langlows, who's triple teamed. She falls down, but somehow gets it to Lillian Bloodworth in time. Dogs lead 43-42. The Bulldogs hang on thanks to Langlow's huge night. She'd put up a 21-point, 22 rebound, and four block effort in a 47-42 win. We were seeing red in the 4A boys semifinal between Haleyville in Cherry and West Morgan in Maroon. Just under six minutes to play. West Morgan down three. Tiarius Mosley picks this line's pocket, goes the other way. But Jamari Burgess right back to Mosley for the reverse two-hand slam. West Morgan down one, tied with 10 seconds left. Landon Henderson was the hero, sinking the buzzer beater three to win it. 50-47 final. Then we had our first of two regional finals, Bell Green in Marion County. Dakota Green scores a game-high 22 points, but the Bulldogs never led in what became a 12-point defeat. And finally, a matchup of teams separated by the Tennessee River. We had Schultz Christian and Covenant Christian in the 1A Boys Northwest Final. Both teams had awful nights from the field, but worse off for Schultz Christian, they couldn't overcome their penchant for fouling. Two-time defending champions Covenant Christian, they're back in the Final Four with a big win. Well, that'll do it for us here at Wallace State. When we come back, Nick will have more from the Northeast region. In Hansville, Simon Williams, Fox 54 Sports.